Hi and welcome to Shop RJPC for great deals on eBay. Today is June 22nd, 2019. Thank you for tuning in. I just want to start off by saying thank you to all the new subscribers who recently subscribed to my channel. It is greatly appreciated. I hope you like the content and come back for more. Today, folks, I want to focus in. I was doing, um, uh, what do you call it? I got uh, a notification from somebody who follows me on my YouTube, on my YouTube videos and happened to be with the Sony Dream Machine. And I was reading the comments and then I don't know if I ever got around to doing it. If I didn't, I do apologize to the uh, person. I don't know if they were a subscriber or just somebody just at the channel and they just asked that question. Um, they were asking about how do I embed videos on your, your uh, eBay listings. And I want to try to make this a quick, brief tutorial as you know, quick as possible. Uh, I don't want to take too much time. Uh, it, is a, it's a, it is a nice, great weekend so far. I'm over here in the East Coast of New York. and. It's going to close be Saturday and Sunday. It's supposed to be a really nice day. So uh, I like to try to get outdoors sometime today and, uh, you know, break away from the computer, so to speak, for a little while. So without further ado, let's get into um, how I embed videos uh, in my e uh, YouTube, YouTube, eBay listings. So let's get right to it. Okay. In order to get to this stage, now this is my eBay listing, and this is what the person's inquiring. How do you embed a video in your eBay listing? You can see it's, it's an eBay listing. That's why I'm scrolling down here. Okay, so a lot of people are wondering, how do you do it? What's the, you know, how do you, how do you get your video embedded in, in, in eBay, on an eBay listing? You want it like this. I mean, I don't blame you, I do too. Videos, I think in some cases, can help, as far as I'm concerned. But then again, there are people that may agree to disagree. All right, so how do we get this in here? All right, first off, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna walk you through it the best I can. I'm gonna try to keep this short and sweet, you know. So I hope you can bear with me. The first thing you want to do is um, after you create your video, like I did here. All right, now if you noticed, the video I'm gonna show you is this one right here. See, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go back to this one here. I already did it, so I'm not going to create another video just yet to, you know, do it again. You're going to see how it's done, so you'll get a, you'll get the justification of it. All right, so you clicked on the, vi I clicked on this video, just the one I did yesterday, and when you click it on, um, of course, it's going to be like that. You're going to pause it. Okay, we don't want to play that. Pause, please. <laughs> pause. <laughs> I don't want to stop. Okay, let's try this again. It wants, it wants to play. All right, let's try this again. All right, what you want to do is you want to share it. So you're going to do is after you, you create your video, first the first thing you want to do is create your video. I'm sorry if I left that out. You want to create your video first. Okay, so after you create your video first, you upload it to YouTube. Okay, so now it's there. It's on YouTube. So what you want to do is click on the share button like this. You click it on. You're going to come across share a link. Now, you could share your video on any one of these uh, social platforms right here. Reddit, Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, the more the merrier. The more you get out, the better, right? All right. What you want to do is you want to click on embed, all right? Now, there's a link here. You just copy this and so I'll just, uh, rather than going through what you're going to show me, you might you might say, you might think this is just as easy as this, and it, it is, but I like the video, okay? So you're going to click on embed. You're going to get this window that's going to pop up, okay? Now, they got a thing called YouTube Converter, all right? I'll drop the link below in the comment section. What you're going to do is, you're not going to mess around with any of these things here. You're not going to mess around with enable privacy enhanced mode and all that stuff, start at. You could start it, but I just leave that unchecked. What you want to do is, you want to go like this. You want to copy this here, like that. Right click, copy. Then you're going to go to a program called YouTube Converter. All right. Now, the let me give the URL. All right. Now, to play, you, if you can't get it, if I don't if I get to do it, just look over here and you just copy it down. It's www. I S D N T E K dot com forward slash tag bot forward slash YouTube. I guess dot com. I don't know. It looks like the rest of it's cut off. Anyway, I'm going to copy and paste the link anyway just to give you a heads up on. What you're going to do is you're going to come over here. So it says YouTube, uh, YouTube or Vimeo code converter for eBay 2018 2019. So it, this is pretty much updated. I mean, I know it is because I use it. So what you're going to do is you're going to you're going to paste that in there. Now remember, we just copied that off of here. Right? We copied it from YouTube. Okay. So now you're going to go over here to the converter, and you're going to paste it in here. And you see here, you're going to scroll down here. So it says, then click May Make eBay Code button below. Once you click this here, it jumps down here, and now you have the code right here. Okay. This is what's going to show up on your 
your eBay listing. All right. So what I usually do is I just left click it, scroll down, copy, right? Then I do is I go to a program called, oh, I bumped out of here. I'm sorry, guys. Let me just do see. This is uh, front page 2000. I'll show you. This is what I use. I'm sorry, guys. I should open that window up. I apologize about that. My apologies. Sorry. So what I do is now what I'm going to do is now I'm going to show you. I'm going to, there's two features on this. This is uh, front page 2002. It's old version, but it works for me. Okay. I like it. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just close over here like that. So you see there's two things. Look at the bottom window of my mouse cursor. You got normal HTML, right? Now you notice this is for the Panasonic. I was I, I uploaded yesterday. The video is embedded in that, but now you don't see it. You say, well, I don't see no video here. Where is it? Okay. Well, you're going to do well. This is again, if you use a front page 2000. Now, whatever program you're working with, that's a whole other story. But I'm just trying to show you how to cut through the chase and just show you how I embed the videos on my thing. The rest will be up to you how you want to do it. Okay. So you click on the HTML code. All right. Now I I don't know this here. I mean, I know very little of HTML. What I'm going to do is I scroll down to the bottom, all the way down to the bottom. See so it says HTML right here. So my mouse cursor. I'm going to, I just copy that, right, that, uh, that uh, the uh, code. So now I'm going to right click, I'm going to paste it. Now you say, okay, all right, I don't see anything. You're not going to see anything until you click the normal button. And again, this is front page 2002. When you click the front, when you click the button for normal, this is how it shows up on your, uh, your listing. So what I do is, now I'm just showing you, I can't, I can't copy and paste like this and link itself. But what you're going to do is go back to your eBay listing. We'll go back to eBay. All right. Let's pretend we're going to do a whole new listing here. All right. We'll go to eBay, whatever. Um, let me click another window here, my eBay, and I'm going to show you. All right. So now you go into eBay and you're going to sell something here. All right. You're going to do another sell. Come on. My system is really slow, folks. And you're going to do a sell here, right? We want to sell. Let's just uh, pick something here really quick. I don't know, just to open something up here. Um, I don't know. Let's see. Where am I? Let's just pick. Let's just say I'm going to show you something like this here. I'm going to I'm going to put it on, take it off. But uh, I'm using it as an example. Okay, I'm using this the first one here. All right. So when you pretend this is a new listing, all right. Now I'm going to revise it. Okay, which I'm not going to really revise this here. I'm going to put that in there, that that information. What you're going to do. Okay, this is for all intents and purposes. I know it's it's the different things for shoes that was for the uh, Panasonic. What you're gonna do is this. I'm not, I'm not gonna click it on all the way, so it'll be okay. I could do this here. When you come over here, you see it says standard and HTML. All right now, this is for the Dexter Blue Canvas sneakers. Right. What you're gonna do is when you go to uh, eBay, your listing, click on HTML. Now, if you're going to revise a new program, you know, a new listing, and you want to use this, you want to use this one, but you want to revise it. Right click, select all, right? Copy and you cut it. Okay, so now you got a clean HTML window. What I do is I go back to the front page 2002. I click on HTML. Right click, select all, copy, right? Then I go back to my listing, go back to the window here, the HTML one on, on, on eBay, right click, paste. Now you just copied all that coding in here, all right, from front page 2002. Now you don't see it, of course, but when you click on and you scroll down, there it is. And then you would go down to the window here, which I'm not going to save it, and then you just hit update listing. It's cut and dry. It's very simplified, and you should have no problem doing this here, folks. Okay, uh, like I said, it's all in this program here. How it's coded with that with this program here, um, this YouTube and Vimeo code converter. All right. So uh, just keep that in mind for those of you who want to embed videos in your eBay listing. That's how you go about doing it, and that's why. That's why. Now let me let me back at this because I don't want to change that there, uh, and that's how I ended up getting this uh you know that this video well actually getting this into this okay and you can see there's no smoke and mirrors this is an ebay listing there it is see i'm on ebay site 
So that's how it's done. Somebody asked me at this year, I don't know if I did it. And if I if I didn't respond to your comment, please accept my humble apologies. It was definitely a, an oversight on my behalf. Um, I, I, for the most part, folks, I always try to accommodate everybody's needs when it comes to things of this nature. I really do. I, I want to I wanna help people out the best I can. I always say, if I can't help them out monetarily, at least I could try to help them out you know, we show it through my videos. So I do hope you guys like it. And I, with that, I'm going to bump out. I'm going to close this video out. I told you I'm going to try to make it short and sweet. If you have any additional questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. But let me just close out this video, all right? Okay, folks. There you have it. This concludes that video. It's a short tutorial. I don't know how long it's going to be. I honestly don't know, but I'm trying to keep it really short because... I know sometimes my videos run long and I do apologize, but you know, when you're doing demo videos or intro videos or sneak peek videos, you can only keep it so small, you know, short, the video so short, you know what I'm saying, before you end up over, you know, going over time, you know what I'm saying. I don't like to keep it too, too long, but um, I, I try to get a lot of information in there and, you know, I don't really want to shortcut anything. I want to, I want to give you the full, full kit and caboodle when it comes to things of that nature. But anyway, listen, I hope it helped. Like I said, I hope that little tutorial helped on how to embed videos in um, your eBay listings. If you like, I said again, if you do have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Um, I'll leave that hyperlink uh, for the um, YouTube converter in there, so you can copy and paste it into your browser. Um, I'm using front now. Just want to let you know, I'm using Front Page 2002 to do that. Now, I don't know if you have a program. I'm sure you have programs that you're working with. Uh, it, it should be the same thing. All it is, it's just a matter of, and you know something, folks, um, now I, the more I think about it, you don't even really need probably front page 2002. All you got to do is just copy that link and, you know, incorporate it in your eBay listing by clicking the HTML code thing like I showed you. You know what I'm saying? You're going to play around with it. You're going to you're gonna get the just of it. Believe me, it took me a little while to figure it out. I was like, well, what am I doing with this here, this, that, and the other thing? But eventually, once you get it, it's going to be like second nature. You're going to say, oh, boom, I could pop a video in my YouTube, you know, my eBay listing, one, two, three. The most important thing is, is um, you know, first thing you got to do is make that, that video, that YouTube video. On what you're doing if it's going to be a demo video sneak peek video whatever video you're going to do uh, create your video first right like I said um, just to recap some of the stuff then once you, re you created your video hit that share button hit the embed code and you'll get it open up that window I'll drop that link below again for that uh, that website there for the converter and then once you do that where you make the code for eBay you select all copy you go to eBay listing, open up that HTML, not the standard one, the HTML window, and then you paste it in there. And then when you want to see what it looks like, then you click the standard, and that's what it'll show you. Because you know, I think even if you don't uh, click it back to standard, I think when you upload it automatically your listing, I think it'll come out that way. But don't quote me on it, okay? I, I'm not sure because I'm so old-fashioned that way. Once I, I, I'm, I mean, I'm one of these type of people that. Uh, once I get to the, you know, I get I get it down path and get it down to the science. I like to use that that particular format. So for me, I don't like changing anything around. You know, they sometimes say change is good. Sometimes it is, and sometimes it ain't. Uh, I like to leave things simplified. I hope this video was simplified enough for you guys out there. Okay, so uh, if you do, and if you, you know, if you do use this and it works. Drop me a comment below. Let me know. Say, hey, Rich, you know, I use that there. It works. I like it. I like the way it did. Thanks for, you know, showing me the tutorial. Oh, if you want to thank me, I mean, I would appreciate it. If you do, give it a thumbs up. And uh, that'd really be great. Like I said, I don't mind helping people out, folks. That's why I do my YouTube channel. It's to help people out. That's why we say I call it the His Initiative, to help, inspire, and share. I do want to help people out, you know. I wish I could do it monetarily, but unfortunately, I'm not there yet. And that's why another thing, I'm trying to... I'm trying to get this channel to grow to thousands and thousands of subscribers so I can monetize it and, you know, go onto a Patreon account and stuff like that. And people say, you know, you think, well, you know, you monetize it, you know, uh, because people know that when you monetize a channel, uh, eventually you do get revenue from it, which, which, which is good, which is a good thing. Uh, it supports the channel. It keeps me going. I create. I can get to create nice videos out there for you guys, helpful videos. And while I'm on the topic of this here, before I close it out, 
Um, I just want to say one thing to the, to the new subscribers and well, the, the prior ones, they know the ones that are already loyal subscribers, but for the new ones, um, I do not discuss religion and politics on this channel and there's no profanity. As a matter of fact, I consider this channel a kid safe channel. Okay. Uh, you're not going to see crazy talk. Uh, I do like to joke around. Like I do play around with my, uh, you know, I have my video editing software and sometimes I'll show you how to's with that there. Um, I use two particular, um, what do you call it there, video editing software, which was CyberLink PowerDirector 14. And I also use Filmora, the 8.76 version. I know this Filmora 9, but I love the 8.76. Filmora 9 is great. Uh, I, I've been toying around with it. I use it on occasion, once in a while. But I love my 8.76 version for more. And that's what I create a lot of my videos. 99.9% .9 of my videos are created with Filmora. Uh, I love the video and so forth. Cut and dry, cut and paste. As a matter of fact, it's very user friendly. Um, you know, if you want to look for a good video uh, editing software, I highly recommend you try Filmora. Well, the new one, you're going to be getting the new one. Uh, because the, as far as the old the version I have, you can't download that anymore. Not that I know of. You may be. You may be able to. I don't know. But right now, the current one they got is Filmora 9. Uh, it's good. It's got a lot of bells and whistles to it. I like it. Um, I guess when I start playing around with it a little more, get familiarized with it, uh, then I'll probably, you know, eventually just grandfather, you know, just grandfather myself into that that software, for, you know, that new version. But right now, I like the, like the 8.76 version. I, I know it, like, almost down to the science. Still a lot to learn, but I know it, though, you know. I feel comfortable with it. But anyway, listen, let me let you guys go. I don't want to keep rambling on because I could talk to you guys all day. I love, <laughs> I love sharing stuff with you guys. I really do. Um, and if, if you're in the East Coast or in New York, enjoy this weather. Take advantage of it. Try to get outdoors. I'm going to try to do that today. I'm going to step out for a little bit because, like I said, I'm on this computer seven days a week from 6.30 in the morning till 12 midnight, 12.30, whatever. And, you know, uh, I, I, sometimes you got to get away. you got to break away from it because, you know, it's just too much after a while, you know. So um, definitely, if you could do it, guys, try to get out of the house for a little bit, you know, especially if you're in your own business. I know people say, well, if you're in your own business, you don't have time to get away. Well, even if you get away for an hour or two, just step away from the computer. You know, give your eyes a break from this here. Uh, me, I'm always constantly brainstorming stuff I want to do for my YouTube video and you know, my YouTube channel. Um, I'm always thinking of stuff to uh, how to improvise on my uh, eBay listings to try to, you know, get them higher in search, make sales, you know. And that's another thing too, folks. Um, if you get a, you know, if you get a chance, check out my listings while you're here. You know, if you if you, if you choose to do so, uh, check out my listings. Everything is with the best offer. I know a lot of people offer best offer, but right now you're on my channel, so I mean, I want to share that information with you guys. I know there's other guys out there and millions of uh, other. Uh, eBay guys out there, sellers and stuff, but right now we're on my channel, so uh, I just want to, you know, let you guys, you know, check it out. Also, uh, and, and also I just want to state this as well, um, when it comes to uh, purchasing, if you are going to make any purchases, I said this in my, a couple of my other videos, check out my feedback score first. You know, just see what else, all I'm saying is if you can take the time, I'm not saying read all of them, but just read like maybe, I don't know, maybe 5, 10, 15, whatever you want, and just see what other people are saying uh, about my services and let me know you know and, and that'll give you a better idea like hey should I buy from this guy or not you, you, I think you'd be very happy with the service and I always work with my buyers I mean if you guys make best or reasonable best offers I'm always willing to work with you guys honestly so please uh, take the time and the initiative and you know do your research I know you're gonna go you know searching around for better deals uh, but again if you look at my listings and they are you think they are this guy's pricey Make an offer. I, I can't. I can't come to you. You got to come to me with that. You got to make the offer to me. I, you know. I mean, I've tried to um, make the offers to the watches that are watching on there. You know, with eBay's new thing that we can make an offer to the watches. I tried it, but I'm not getting any bites. <laughs> so uh, I don't know. Am I? Is it really that high where you can't even? You know, maybe people don't want to buy. I don't know. I, I won't know. So definitely check it out. Anyway, this is Rich Bassini signing off. I don't know if we're going to be able to do the reseller news later on today or not. i got to see what time I get back, whatever. Uh, but I also want you guys to know for the new uh, subscribers, I also do the reseller news. It's it's kind of like a, a variety channel. You know, it's an open forum. I talk about different things on this YouTube channel. So um, I hope you guys don't mind, you know. I hope I don't scare you away. But no, but definitely, you know, keep, keep in touch with me. Uh, and by, like I said, by subscribing, like, comment, and share. And again, if you want to be notified as to when I uh, post that new videos, please hit that bell notification icon. Until next time, my name is Rich Bassini. 
Have a great weekend. Bye-bye now.